Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can download and install Docker on your Ubuntu operating system. We are going to install Docker using standard Ubuntu repositories. But if you want to install Docker using the Docker website, it's also fine. So let me show you if you want to uh, install the latest and greatest version, then what you can do is you can just search for install uh, Docker Ubuntu. And then the first link which will appear here will be from docs.docker.com and I'm going to just click on this link and when you scroll down in uh, this page you will be able to see uh, different methods of installing Docker on your Ubuntu operating system. The first is install using repositories. So using this method you will get the latest and greatest uh, version of uh, Docker on your Ubuntu operating system. The second way of installing Docker on your Ubuntu operating system is by just installing it via the standard Ubuntu library. So whenever you first give this uh, Docker command on your Ubuntu operating system and then press enter, you will see that it's going to say command Docker not found but can be installed with this uh, command. So we are going to use this command. Uh, and whenever you install docker using this command also it's going to work uh, perfectly fine it may be a little bit older version but it's going to work uh, for all of your needs so i'm going to just copy this uh, command from here and then uh, paste it on the terminal and then press enter and then i'm going to just uh, give my ubuntu's password and then press enter and then press y and then press enter once again which is going to start the download of the docker on your ubuntu operating system so i will wait for this process to complete so once this command is done i'm going to clear the terminal and let's check which uh, version of docker is installed so i'm going to just give the docker hyphen hyphen version command and it's going to uh, give me this result which says uh, docker version 19.3.8 so this might not be the latest version but uh, it will work for all of your needs uh, hopefully now uh, let's check whether docker is uh, running or is it enabled and if it's not enabled then we are going to uh, start this uh, service by enabling it and then starting it so to do this you can just give this command sudo systemctl and then uh, just write uh, status and then just write uh, docker here and then press enter so you can see uh, it says it's loaded but right now it's inactive or dead okay so to enable it what we can do is we can give this command so instead of status this time we are going to say enable here and then I'm going to just give this flag which is now and then press enter which is going to start and enable uh, the docker so when you uh, just see the status once again you will see that now it's active and running okay if it doesn't work out of the box then just reboot your Ubuntu operating system and see if this status is active and running or not okay so once you see uh, that this uh, status is active and running here then uh, you can uh, just press Q to just exit from this command and then we are going to just clear the terminal once again and now let's check whether docker is uh, working with the docker hub and uh, uh, let's just give and test whether docker is working generally on our uh, Ubuntu operating system or not so the simplest command to test docker is just give this command docker run hello hyphen world okay and then press enter so you can see it says got permission denied while trying to connect to a uh, docker daemon we are going to uh, once again give this command with the sudo privileges okay so just give sudo and then give docker run hello hello world command and now this command has worked and let me uh, just briefly uh, tell you what this command has done so first of all uh, docker is going to search for this hello world image into your local uh, ubuntu operating system so you can see uh, unable to find image 
hello world latest latest is the tag locally so docker has tried to find this uh, image locally and if this image is not present locally then it's going to pull the latest version of hello world image from the docker hub repository so that's what uh, it is doing in this command and it's pulling this image from the repository and after that it's going to run this image from this repository and if you see uh, this hello from docker message then everything is working on your docker with your ubuntu operating system you can now also run this command docker images after giving the hello world command and once again it gives me uh, this permission so i should always use sudo before giving the docker commands right and you can see now it's giving me uh, this image which is the image which i have pulled from uh, the docker hub recently okay so whenever you give docker images command it's going to uh, give you the list of all the images which you have locally on your ubuntu operating system so this is how you can uh, download and install and enable docker on your ubuntu operating system i hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you in the next video